Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, welcome. If you're not, welcome back. So today I will be recreating this iconic graduation picture and showing you how to wear a grad cap if you have curly hair because some of the tutorials I've seen, they are for like girls because they can get away with a headband. My sides are shaved, so obviously I can't just wear a headband. I don't want to look like that. So I'm going to be showing you how I did it last year for my graduation and hopefully this can help you out. But anyways, let's get started. Okay, so this is what my hair is looking like. It's pretty frizzy and it's just in need of some life. But I'm actually gonna be doing this on old hair anyway, so I'm not gonna wash my hair. We're just gonna work with it and wet it. This is what my grad cap looks like if you guys were wondering and wanted to read it. Okay, so the first thing we're gonna do is take our hat, our cap, and we're gonna measure where we want it to sit on our head. So I think I want a lot of hair out, so probably like this much. I think that's good. And now I'm gonna grab that hair that was inside of the hat And I'm gonna take my black shoelace. I'm using black because it'll hide better in my hair than my gray one. But you won't really be able to see either, so it doesn't really matter, but. Okay, I'm gonna tie that. And if you have more hair, you can always make your bun smaller or whatever. I didn't for the sake of the video, but that's always an option. And you can even wet it if you wanna smush it down even more. Okay, so this is what my hair is looking like so far. I'm gonna clip the front section just to hold it while we try the hat on. And now we're gonna see if this fits how we want it. Okay, so it's fitting so far. So what I'm gonna do is take the clip out. We're gonna take our bobby pins and we're gonna clip one side at an angle. Clip the other side. And then we're gonna clip the middle. Two times, so another one across. Okay, so this is pretty secure. So now what we're gonna do is wet the front of my hair. Just cover your cap so you don't get it wet. And if your hair's looking good, you don't have to do this, but since it's gonna be in pictures and all of that, I'm just gonna restyle it anyways. Now I'm gonna take my curl enhancing smoothie. I'm gonna take probably this much. And next I'm gonna take my kinky curly curling custard. If I can get it open. And I'm probably gonna take, let's see, this much. And 
re-wet it. Comb this through. Add a little bit more. And I'm actually gonna shingle it just so it's not frizzy at all. But you don't have to shingle if you don't want to. Okay guys, so I just finished shingling and this is what my hair is looking like. So now I'm actually gonna diffuse for probably like 20 minutes and then I'll come back and show you how it's looking. And this is how it dried after I finished diffusing. Okay, so I'm gonna put some pictures if you guys wanna see more of what my hair looked like last year. But really, that's it for this video. Thank you for watching. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up and I'll see you in the next one.